went into my trading account and I just made a whole bunch of trades that I knew was wrong. And in the process, I lost a lot of money. Ooh, I'm hot. Hey loves, so something happened to my car. I was driving and I was on, I was on the highway and it started making that tick 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 sound like you know how you try to start the car and like the cranking star when your battery's dead um the cranking star <laughs> cranking start i don't know when you're trying to start it and i don't know okay so your battery's dead you try to start it um it makes that tick 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 sound that's the sound it was making while i was driving so i have this friend Ooh. Hold on. I saw the Ma trailer. And I was like, this looks, I don't know. It looks crazy good. Crazy good. Um, It's like get out reversed. It's just, I just want to see how it turns out. Well, anywho, I have this friend and she has been really down lately. She's been going through a lot. She's one of my good friends. Um, I've been there, there for her through. Oh my god, I cannot talk. <laughs> I cannot talk. Okay, so I have been there for her through like a lot. And she has just been really down lately. And you know, I've been spending time with her, trying to speak life to her. You know, telling her that, you know, things are going to get better and all that type of stuff. I did not realize that it was also bringing me down and my mindset was just I don't know I just started to feel down and I did spend a lot of time with her sleepovers um hours with her half of the day sometimes the whole day just trying to you know make her feel better a few weeks ago I had four flat tires and all that crazy stuff like everything happened to the car like just everything um everything was just going wrong so the way I handled those you know those um situations I just I handled them differently than how I would have normally handled them if I wasn't so down so um I was just super stressed I felt burnt out and all that extra stuff and I do have this friend that I was talking to um he we just stopped talking like of course we're still friends but it was just yeah it's a whole other story um I did I did feel like a part of me was gone and I felt like my heart was broken as most of you already know I do trade Forex I have to say if you don't trade Forex I feel like you are missing out and even if you don't like stuff like that I feel like everybody should give it a try it's just you know it's to me it's it's amazing okay so I have, you know, I trade Forex and because of, you know, I was heartbroken, stressed and all that kind of stuff. Sorry. And all that kind of stuff. I just went into my trading account and I just made a whole bunch of trades that I knew was wrong. And in the process, I lost a lot of money. Um, I think I lost about a hundred and fifty. $150,000 um let me look let me pull it up for you yeah 152 152 I thought it was 150 but it's 152 is that focused yeah I guess it's focused I don't know Ugh. Yeah, so I was just, yeah, so, um, but I did, I did come to the realization, like, after, 
like maybe about a week later I realized that <laughs> this is not where I want my life to go um, and it was just not good at all after you know that pep talk to myself I did get back into my forex I got back into my modeling and I am getting back to my nutrition business just trying to be a little more consistent with that and I did get back into my forex copier so I am you know I'm just back to the way I'm supposed to be the way I usually am you know the positive vibes promoting self-growth um, at the same time I am um, spending more time on myself because I feel like I was not I spent most of my energy um, always helping somebody else and always making sure that somebody else is you know doing good they're okay and it's like I kind of neglected myself a little bit um, because I all my energy was just trying to help I mean of course I am going to help others I'm, I'm also going to be mindful to myself and make sure that I take the time I need to myself for myself but this whole morning has just been I don't know I'm puzzled if that's the word yeah I'm puzzled um but yeah so um that's that and the case right now with my friend I am still trying with her um I don't know what to do um I have tried everything I maybe I haven't tried everything I don't know it's just in a very dark place I feel where she's coming from because I have been in a very dark place myself um that's a whole other story I feel like she has to want to get out of that place because um my dark place I don't know I just kind of just I don't know just kind of just like I kind of just grew like I kind of had to do it by myself I took that step by myself to get out of that dark place um it was um I don't know I'm like so scared for her and I don't know um she doesn't want to like go to talk to anybody talks to me and all that stuff but if she were to you know I feel like she's afraid to go talk to like somebody else like a professional or just a therapist or you know a counselor because of the standards like it almost this um, society I don't know this generation almost makes it feel like it's a negative thing to go talk to somebody like you know to a professional it's you know it's I think that she's just afraid of what other people are gonna say or what other people are gonna think but I don't know what else to do you know I've been telling her that you know yeah it's not it's not okay because I can't say it's okay and I can't say like you know the past is not gonna try to crawl back up to you because it has happened to me a lot of time you can pave the road to where you want to go you know where you want to be you know focus on the present because at the end of the day how you think I feel like your mind is a powerful thing what you think is what you going to attract and what you're around a lot is what you going to attract she does have other friends that are not such a good influence and you know I don't know if maybe that's it maybe she needs to get out of that environment I don't know but I am trying I do want her to I don't know it hurts me to see somebody else hurting so so bad anyways you guys um always keep a positive mindset know that 
whatever you are in right now, whatever situation, um, it can be bad. You are going to get through it. It's not impossible. Trust me, I have. <laughs> I have been through a lot. Have you ever seen um, the movie Bird Box? Like when she was in the river? Yeah, that's how my life was going. Just blindfolded in the river. Just, you know, with the current, you know, the good, the bad. <laughs> All that kind of stuff. Just, you know, a lot of turbulence. If you guys get what I mean. But if you are going through something, know that you will get through it. You can get through it. Um, nothing is impossible. And for every negative thought, think of two positive thoughts. So you can just, you know, be in that, you know, positive mindset and attract positive energy and all that good stuff. So I'm not going to get to it. I'm not going to start preaching. Um, I'm going to try out my car now. Hopefully it works and I will be posting I will try to be a little bit more consistent and all that stuff I just I just did not want to post because I felt so down and I feel like the vibe will just come off as you know it's not gonna be the right you know you know what I mean it just shows like cuz I have watched um, YouTube videos and you can just tell that the person doesn't really want to do it or they've had a bad day or just something like that but all right loves I will see you in my next video this is going on way too long right now the video it's just going on way too long <laughs>